And I don't think any of you guys watched it. It had 10 views. I just took down my last Simpsons comics collection. Um, not because it's not my last one. I got more Simpsons comics. But because I wasn't happy with the upload. It's kind of... It ran long, which it, this one probably will. And although it has the same problems as a lot of my... As a lot of my other videos do, it just kind of seems like too much for me. I don't know why. I mean... If it seems too much for the person uploading it, obviously it's going to be a lot for the person that's watching it. I should just do that. I should do that for a lot of my other videos. But, again, a lot of them have comments on them, so I don't want to do that. Alright, so, yeah, this is my last Simpsons comics collection showing. It's all the same ones. I should probably get the other ones, but... Eh, I don't really feel like it. Probably should, though. Hmm. I sold... Three of them, and I have another two. Um, a lot of those ones, the singular issues, are in pretty bad shape, and I'm just I'm selling the I'm selling the best, selling the ones that are in the best shape because no one's gonna want a comic that to cover is off of. I don't know how it got like that. I don't know if it was like with if I was traveling with them. I mean, I should have put them in poly bags. They put like uh, said I put them in a backpack. I was going away and I wanted to read some Simpsons comics. And then they just got ripped off. I don't know. Um, so yeah, this is my last collection because I'm sick and tired of buying them. I don't like them anymore. I'm sorry. It, I don't know if it's growing up. Um, and some of these I liked. You know, some of these I'll like, like say, Dollars to Donuts, which is spoiler again. for Not again, but I, I uploaded two videos tonight. And I'm referring back to the other video I uploaded, which is uploaded now. And it's just showing in new comics I got that one Simpsons comics. Already a minute and a half, already two minutes. Um, so, you know, maybe I'll, with dollars to donuts, I'll be like, oh, I liked this one. Um, it's a gamble, you know? I was reading one, even that one I didn't really like, and I'll show you that one's knockout. Simpsons comics knockout. And it's just like, why buy something just for the views? And they're not even getting views anymore before... Back in the day when I liked them, and again, like I was said in the other cut that you might have seen, the cut that I deleted, it was profitable because I liked the show. I mean, like I still like the show. I liked the comics. I let in the get, get views. I don't like the show now, but I, st I still love the show. Don't don't get me wrong. I still binge watch that show from time to time. I'll do that tonight. Um, okay, radioactive again. Radioactive repository. I just didn't give it to say okay, but I said the wrong thing because I don't know why did I do that. Um, I don't know if the repository is a pun, radioactive repository. I know it's an alliteration, but not a pun. Uh, if you don't use no, no, we do, for those of you who don't know, alliteration is like Peter Parker, Bruce Banner, you know, similar sounding names with uh, like this two B's, you know, B first name, B last name. Anyways. Futurama Crossover Crisis. This is probably was one of my favorite ones. And when I heard they were coming out with the um, crossover, um, the actual show itself, I was like, dude, just use this as the script. You don't need to um, try, basically. I'm glad with I'm glad the storyline which they did I actually like it to this day better than the Simpson better than the Family Guy crossover and that's only because they used the humor from Futurama and they meshed well with the Simpsons yeah it's by the same author by the same author by the same um, I'm sure, I think you guys can read by the same um, creator but both shows are are still different enough. To where they have different humor and they still mesh well. Family Guy, the Family Guy crossover was stupid. I watched it again recently, and it was—it's just—it's okay. But if you if you judge by a Simpsons episode, it's awful. But if you judge by how the show is now, it's not that bad. I have no idea how this got in bad shape. Like I said in the other cut. With the same video, but I had to delete it. Deleted. I had to delete it. Like active YouTube was like, oh, we'll take it down. I don't know how I got like this. I don't know if I had shoved it. Like I said before, I don't know if I had shoved it in like this. Like say this is like, so like, I'll show you specifically. 
like like this. It's like, oh, let's get this. Maybe it was like that. I don't care if it's in worse shape. Oh, I'm gonna read it again. Probably will. Big shot. Supernova. Supernova. I don't know why I said that. The very first one. It takes me back. Confidential. And I, I've seen, I've looked through this in the other cut. I really want Simpsons World. I think, I, I looked it up recently. I've looked it up a bunch of times in the past, because I think that uh, Amazon would put it on their Prime account, which is the only thing I'll buy from them, because it's guaranteed two-day free shipping. Not guaranteed two-day, but it's guaranteed free shipping. Meltdown. Um, and one time it was for rent. Why would I ever get something that's not, um, a school textbook for rent? No. I'm not doing that. Maybe for a comic that I didn't like as much. Like, I was like, like this. This is more expensive. Okay, backstory. This was more expensive at the comic book store, at, at the, on Amazon. And I went to the, the National Comic Book Store. I'm not allowed to go back there. Okay. Got banned. Anyways, um... I was a stupid idiot, it, was, it wasn't related to this, um, it was a stupid moron, and I was like, oh, oh. My, my dad wanted to get a refund, because, not refund, okay. You'll notice that it's not in the best condition, it looks used. This is how I bought it back in the day. Back in the day, I think it was ten years ago. Um, <laughs> and my dad noticed the condition, and I was like, dude, you... I don't think he said it to me because I would have, would have we would have talked about it and he and I wouldn't have been an idiot. Basically, he wanted to get at a reduced price, it's already ten bucks, and me, the idiot, was like, "Oh, let's do this comic book sales." And then he was talking to my dad, and I interjected with, "Oh, it's more expensive on Amazon," and they have a bargain bin, so it should have been in their bargain bin because it looks used. And I've gotten their used section books that were. In better condition, and I still have to pay ten bucks. I feel I still to this day think that I could have gotten it at a reduced price if I hadn't opened my big mouth, which I still do to this day. Knockout. I think you guys are gonna knock me out if I trail off again. <laughs> Even back then, I didn't. I said this in either cut. Um, that I didn't like the older ones as much as the newer ones, which is the exact opposite of how I feel about the Simpsons show. Um, it's because. And then I don't mean to get newer, newer ones. I like this font. Um, these ones, especially by the ones by Ian Boothby, felt like the show. But now it just kind of feels like the show, but I'm reading the show. It's like I'm reading the script to the show. But they did little illustrations. But, I don't know. It's just like, and it's not me. I mean, it's not, it's not the comic itself. I don't know what it is. I don't know, I don't, I don't, I don't even know why I keep stuttering. I don't know if it's me, and that's sick, sounds stupid to say. But I don't know if it's me or the comic. I'm gonna, oh, the other one is Bart Simpson Breaks Out. I have out there, I keep forgetting. Alright, it's just Spectacular. Um, so this one, Spectacular, um, was one that was, it was kind of funny for me. Oh, I thought I was in my way. It was funny for me because I didn't know people knew about the Simpsons comics, and why would they? It's a stupid show, it's a stupid comic book. And I mean stupid, like, who would care about it, you know? I mean like them themselves, they want to get Batman for three ninety nine, not Simpsons comics for three ninety nine, where it's a stupid kitsch thing. And again, not in, it's not me saying that, their words, not mine. Um, so it was funny for me to see someone get in a P.O. box, one of the YouTubers I watched. Another one, totally different one, Linkara, it was the one that did the episode on it, and Comic Pop was when I got it in the mail. Um, and I don't, I don't know why I just don't name drop them. It was one of my favorite episodes of Linkara's, though, to see him do a Simpsons comic, it was kind of surreal. And it was a good episode, too. And he did one of the ones on the trios of horror, Hello Bloom. Not Hello Bloom. The one that's not the Friday Fest. The other one. Uh, Breaks Out. That's one I'm, I actually haven't started yet. I'm going to start that tonight. Um, and again, even if I like Breaks Out, like I liked this one. It, this was one of my favorites, but I'm not gonna... Again. 
She's like, I didn't, I, I got some at the comic book store, not the comic book store. I got some at the library, took some out of the library, and I didn't like those ones that much. So, it's a gamble. Will they be like the ones at the library that I didn't like very much? Or will they be like Dollars and Donuts, or, or the Belly Buster one, where I did like it? What's with their naming of that Belly Buster? Like, it's not going to make anyone over the age of 10 want to get it, unless they know it's Simpsons, and they know the show. And they know, they know, they know that the comics are good. Because even by the show standards, so there's like, I'm sure there are shows and movies that there's an Alien vs. Predator comic that I didn't really like. And you can say what you will about the Alien vs. Predator movie, I haven't seen it, so what am I going to find your sense of it? At least it's probably not as bad as the comic. Um, Strike Back, Dollars the Donuts, Speak the Devil. Jam Pack Jamboree. Unchained. A lot of these are cheaper. A lot of them. This one's fourteen ninety nine, and it's a thicker one. Same thicker, thicker one. This says it has one hundred and seventy six pages on Amazon, but it looks much thinner than, say, the Colossal Compendium. It's weird. It's weird. It's weird. Uh, Big Bonanza, a Go Go, Winding, and again, I don't think I like. I don't like this thing again. I don't think I would sell these just to, because of the fact that maybe I'll like them again. Maybe I want to read them again. Just not really want to read them again. I don't know why I didn't just do that in the first place. Um, volumes one, two, three, and for some reason I got six. I don't know why. The one the the thing I like most about these is each of them has a little cardboard cutout, little, little cardboard cutout thing. Um, not that I think this is going to be worth anything in the future, but I kind of don't want to do them myself. That's pretty much because of where I put them. There's no room in my room. <laughs> I learned. Because I said the same word. So yeah, that's it. Um, I'm not going to show you the individual comics, only because... Only not only am I gonna sell the ones that are in the best shape or have already done that, but they're in, the ones that are in bad shape. I want to show they're in worse shape than that explosion comic. All right, that's about it.